perceive things. It's your mind which determines how you live, how you how you move around, what happens to you. Situations will be same. How you analyze them depends upon your state of your mind, how healthy your mind is. I'll tell you, one on a, on a certain day in in a, in a, in a Indian uh, uh, railways, there was this one rich lady who walked inside the compartment with her husband. And you know, she's rich She and she has that in her attitude. So the moment she entered, she started complaining. The fan is not working properly. I'm sweating. Oh, this curtain is not proper. Oh, this con- compartment is stinky. Oh, this is smelling. Oh, this window is not opening properly. She was complaining about everything and everybody in the compartment is just watching her. After some time, she got tired of complaining and both the husband and wife were sitting. So the other people in the compartment, they, were, they started a conversation. So, you know, what do you do, sir? They seem to be rich, you know, good garments and good clothes and decked up. So husband said, well, um, me and my wife, we both are in manufacturing business. So I said, oh, really, sir? What do you manufacture? He said, I manufacture soaps. And what does your wife manufacture? Well, she manufactures her own unhappiness. <laughs> she manufactures her own unhappiness wherever she goes. That's what she manufactures. So, um, yeah, our mind, you know, the way we perceive things, the way, that's why it's very important to keep the mind, mind all right. If, if your mind is all right, no matter where you are, you, you know, you can um, adjust the environment of that um, of that place, you know. Krishna, 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 Lagi, Sab Krishna, 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 Lagi, Sab Krishna, 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 Lagi, Sab Krishna. Krishna.